Pisces, hi. So uh, this is going to be a reading for November 2nd through the 8th. And I'll uh, take a look into your recent past, your current energies, and your immediate future. And then I'll um, close it off with a couple of cards from the universe for you. And these are general readings, so they may not resonate for all of you. If they do, there is an extended at the end of the video. You can check it out in the description box below if you want. Let's see. Come on. Straight them up here. Hmm. All right, so the overall energy for the reading, the Ten of Pentacles. Possibly a home environment we're talking about here. It's interesting because it starts with the Five of Pentacles. It ends with the Death card. Now, the death doesn't necessarily have to be an ending to a situation. It's very transformative. It comes in as change, dramatic change, possible. The Five of Pentacles, though, um, that's a sense of something being done and over with, feeling abandoned in a situation. Especially, um, it came out in reverse, and the Seven of Pentacles came out in reverse. Um, it does look like somebody didn't really want to put in the, the work anymore in a situation. It wasn't lost at that time completely. Um, but somebody just didn't kind of like, come on, do it. Do your part in this kind of thing. Because I see somebody there with the King of Pentacles sitting very secure and very, I'm doing this for this home life kind of thing. So one of the... The two was definitely in it. The other one, I feel like they were in it too, but they weren't participating as much. And I feel like that King of Pentacles may be you there. And the other person was kind of struggling, still trying to keep it together though. But let's see, in the current situation, the Two of Swords, the Four of Cups, the Seven of Swords, there's definitely a tendency to turn your back, to be like, screw this, I'm out you know, kind of deal. There's a lot of confusion, a lot of not knowing what to do about the situation, but the tendency to walk away from it all. At times we get to that place where you're, we're like, I, I'm done, <laughs> you know, I'm done here. I'm out, kind of thing. Uh, not a lot of us do it, <laughs> like follow through with that, but um, we have times, let's just put it that way. Um, in the immediate future, the Eight of Pentacles, the Page of Wands, the Death card. Again, definitely a sense of... It just shows up upside down, pretty much, for you. In the past, where there is a sense of things being done, weren't done, and now in the future, somebody's really wanting to put in the effort, but there's a sense of things being done, kind of thing. You know, it, it, it just kind of shows up flipped. So let me clarify. Let's see what the hell is going on here. Let me clarify the uh, Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Wands, Four of Pentacles, the Temperance. Yeah, somebody's hanging on to this um, commitment here. Even though it's very, very hard to do so, it's like they don't have the other person's collaboration on this. Not fully. It's there, but it's not enough to... It's like taking in the burdens from the other person's side and putting them here. And you're like, I'm the hero. I'm going to do this all by myself. And I'm going to take everything that's hard and heavy from your back. I'm going to put it in my... I'm going to make it. Crap. No, that's not the way to do it. You know, taking somebody else's burdens. But it was like a stubbornness of, we got to make this work. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to feel the heaviness of it all. Just me. You're good. You're safe. You know, kind of deal. I feel like you've learned a lot from that aspect. You know, of taking in their problems, their whatever it is that they were dealing with. Um, let me see that five of pentacles over there in the recent past.
that's freaking beautiful energy ace of cups ten of pentacles ace of pentacles the person again that was a little bit uncooperative here um they wanted this to happen they wanted this beautiful brand new beginning this very practical new beginning between the two of you um you know what it is what's unsettling me here i don't see the effort supporting that when you want something you're gonna go do it you're gonna put in some sort of effort right and i do see the desire and it's real it's not that they're lying or anything it's there it exists and i can't even call this person lazy because it's not that i don't exactly know what stopped them from getting in there uh let me clarify the seven of pentacles because that's the working kind of card that's the putting in the effort so let's see if we can find something in there page of pentacles page of cups the lovers see there was here oh oh okay they were they were but in their own way which is very, very, very slow. Um, this person might be carrying a lot of earth energy. Um, there's definitely an equal give and take here. There's definitely a participation on both sides of making this or creating this stability between the two of you. There's definitely love. The depth that you were feeling these emotions were possibly taking you into a direction of things happening in a much more fast-paced rate than they were. They were very slow in their movement, but I do see them participating. I do see them taking that action. It's like... <laughs> Think of it like this, like you're saying to this person, I love you, and they're responding in two months. You're hearing that response when they actually initiated the response right after you said it to them. It's hard to explain, but that's how the energy comes in. That's how slow they're moving. All right, so there, there's definitely a cooperation here. Wow, that's, uh, that's really... <laughs> For a fire sign, that's scary energy to look at. It's like, oh my god, that's so freaking slow. Uh, but it's, I mean, it's funny when I see that. Because I didn't get it. I'm like, why are they not doing anything? And they were, but I just didn't see it because it was too slow. Let me do the Two of Swords in the current situation. Three of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, Page of Swords. Again, small steps, small steps here. Opening up more and more. I feel like there's a lot of confusion about a partnership. Um, a lot of doubt. Um, it's like whenever whoever this is, is shutting down their emotions, they don't know what to do about the situation. Whenever they're in their heart about it, they know. They know the answer. They know they have love. They know they want to go towards it. And I kind of feel this as being you, you know? Um being very doubtful about a situation and this could be a friendship doesn't have to be the exact same situation it could be a friendship it could be a family situation um there's a little bit of a confusion here until you access your heart that's where you have the answers for this let me clarify the four of cups in the current situation queen of swords two of pentacles knight of pentacles There's, you're dealing with something that created a lot of disappointment for you. And because of that, now you're in a very confused state about it. Like, should I keep going with it? Should I continue this relationship or dynamic or whatever it is that you're dealing with here? Or should I just let it go? And I see your desire to go towards it. It's The desire is there. The determination is there. The disappointment and the confusion are pretty deep. And they might not let you take this action, even though you want it. Um, that's really up to you. Which of those energies you're going to give power to. 
a disappointment or you wanting to go do something here. Let me clarify the Seven of Swords. In the current situation, Ace of Wands, Five of Pentacles, the Chariot. There's also a fear of rejection here, fear that it's not gonna be welcomed, your action, that it's not gonna be welcomed, you know, with opened arms here. Because you feel that the intensity of how much you want to go towards this and fix it, whatever this is, is big. The fear shows up there, though, that's keeping you behind, that's making you actually turn in the other direction. Let me clarify the Eight of Pentacles in the um, immediate future. Two of Wands, Three of Cups, Seven of Pentacles. The more you wait towards these energies to come back together, because I see, again, a sense of reconciliation, a sense of making things happen in a very flowing and good way, very loving way, the more you wait and not take action, and neither are they, the less um, you're going to want to go towards it and make it happen, which makes sense. You know, time, when they say time heals, it means time kind of fucks over <laughs> every kind of aspect of us wanting to take action towards something. Um, but it's like, there's a sense of waiting and waiting and waiting for this to happen. But the more you wait, the less you desire it. Let me clarify the page of wands in the immediate future. Whew. Seven of swords, five of swords, queen of pentacles. All right. It, it's kind of like you've been avoiding to look into yourself, to work on yourself for a very long time. Um, you have, I see that you have here and there, but like really, really, and you were curious about it, you know, to be like, hmm, let's, um, let's see where I'm participating in all of this commotion in my life. Let's see my part in it. You were avoidant of it for a very long time. And that comes in as self-deception and sabotaging yourself. Because you want to grow into big ass powerful Pisces, you know, uh, somebody that's nurturing to themselves first and then to everybody that comes in contact with them. But I feel like you've been avoiding this for quite some time. Let me see the death card. I feel like the situation, whatever is dissipating here, is going to lead you into the direction of yourself. Eventually. So let's see here. The hangman, the six of cups, and the moon. So for right now, there is this feeling that this connection, whatever, um, is gone. Is it's i mean you're not taking any kind of action anymore and because of that you feel like okay it's done you know um i don't know if it is for now yes and i feel like you should uh get to this feeling of it being done but for some reason i feel like there's more to this connection than meets the eye for now and for later in your life definitely um let me see what the universe has for you. <laughs> Five of Wands, Two of Wands, the Chariot. Two of Wands and the Chariot. This is waiting energy. This is fast-paced energy. Uh, you're in a lot of inner conflict because of these energies. Well, I feel like I should go, but maybe I should wait. But maybe I should go. But maybe I should wait. But maybe I should... Lots of conflict there for you. You're kind of doing that um, to yourself. I mean, we all do it to ourselves all the freaking time. So, uh, But that's what I have for you, Pisces. Hope this helped and I'll see you next time. Bye.